Hey, this is Ashley and you guys are watching Ashley Epidemic and today I have some lovely albums here to unbox. I'm very excited. After much tragedy and heartache, I finally received these albums. So I'm really excited to open them. But before I get into that, I just want to let you guys know that today I'm going to be doing the K-pop Secret Santa introduction tags. So I'm going to be doing the Secret Santa again this year, the K-pop Secret Santa. And for that this year, we are doing an introduction tag. So you guys are gonna get to know a little bit more about me. I mean, I'm sure some of you guys probably know this, but there's probably new people that have no idea about me or know very little. So this will work so you guys can get to know me a little bit better and you're gonna get to see what I'm gonna open up right now. So real quick, I'm gonna actually, as I open all this stuff up, I'm gonna start running through the questions. How long have I been making YouTube videos? Um, and so I've actually been making YouTube videos for quite a while. I started out in booktube and I started doing that in 20, late 2014, I think, or early 2015, somewhere around there. Um, 2014, 2015, I started making videos on booktube and then in 2016, I was introduced to K-pop. Yes, it was, it eluded me. Um, and I started making K-pop related content um as of late early 2016 march 2016 was when i opened this channel um i'll be celebrating my four years very very soon i'm very excited about that um but yeah so as you can see here you can probably tell there's a black and there's a white and if you know anything about a black and white album that has come out recently you will know that i am opening up some 80s 80s so this is their first full album okay they're upside down oh this one's upside down that's why I was confused okay so one of them was upside down so this is their into the this it's not a trilogy it's quadrology this is the fourth installment um but this is the final one this is um, episode Finn all to action and there are the two versions um, I forget what the two versions are called I am sorry um, but let's get into the second question who is the group that got you into k-pop so the group that actually got me into k-pop remember guys if you want your albums to if you get these make sure that you do them otherwise they don't count um, so the group that actually got me into K-pop was actually Infinite, um, and it was actually because of Sonastoria, um, but um, I got into Infinite first, and it was kind of all at the same time. Infinite was the first, technically the first video that made me say, hmm, I want to see more, but really in reality, I was really listening to both Infinite, I was listening to Shiny in particular, Taemin stuff, but Shiny in general and then also TVXQ. So those were the people that I was listening to in early 2016 before I started to branch out and listen to others. I spent weeks just listening to those three artists um, and their individual releases. So Tame and Stuff, John Hyun Stuff. Um, yeah, I was very, very, very deeply into Infinite and Shiny in particular, um, more so than TVXQ, but um, Yes, that is also probably the reason why Infinite and Shiny are both in still in my top groups and are <laughs> ones that I love, love, love deeply. So here are the two versions. Um, so let's just go ahead and let's start with this version. I forget which version this is. Let me see if I can find out. Let's start with this version right here. And let's, ugh, I, sometimes I hate boxes. I got a little bit bashed in the shipping. I did order these from My Music Taste, so they do have the additional card in them. And I ordered special shipping. I ordered the DHL faster shipping. So I'm just like, yes, give it to me back. And I figured, yes, I please give me my album sooner if possible. So I did. I regret now. I regret. <laughs> Um, I went through so much trouble. First day that they tried to deliver it, I wasn't home because I'm never home when they deliver packages. Um, and for once, they did not leave it at my door. It was very annoying, but I had to reschedule. 
I rescheduled it, waited all day. I go to check the actual notice in that I received because it never said that it was delivered. Nope. Apparently it had ended up um, pretty much somewhere else. <laughs> um, it had been delivered to a parcel location, even though I want it re-delivered to my place. Got all mixed up. Found out this morning that it was at another parcel place and I went to go get it. So here are the stickers, pretty stickers. Okay, um, and then the postcards. So here's the group. Hongjin. Everybody is losing their minds over Sungwa, but he does look really, really good. <laughs> you know, ooh, wow. You can really see the veins in his hand. Look at that. Like, you can really see those veins. They're just, like, sticking out. Okay. Um... Yosung, he's always just so pretty and delicate to me. He just is. I'm sorry, baby, but you are. I'm putting these down in the wrong direction. San, so in case you don't know, I bias Mingi, and San is my bias wrecker, and San has been coming at me hard this comeback. Mingi, I love Mingi. He's so pretty and precious, and I just love him. And then now we have young so when i collect stuff i go the my collection priority is mingi then san then wu young and then we have oh unit ones so we have a unit another unit Oh, and the tall, I'm going to just call them the tall unit. <laughs> okay, so those are the cards in this version. And let's take a look at what this photo book has to offer. Everybody loses their mind and loves and adores Hong Joon. Oh, San is just ah, Mingi. <coughs> the one two punch of San and Mingi is a little bit too much for me. I really like these outfits on them as well. They look really, really, really good. Oh, oh, look how pretty they are. Okay, so we've got stuff. We got stuff. Okay. So, red card. Is this the My Music Taste card? Nope. This is the, I guess, one of the treasure cards. And let's see. Oh, this photo shoot is just really, really nice. I do quite enjoy it so far. I like men in suits, though. So <laughs> seeing them in uniform like this is it's 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 a good look to me. <laughs> OK, so we've got two cards here. So I will be looking to trade. And then we have the group one. Where's my My Music Taste card? I ordered from My Music Taste just so I would get the My Music Taste thing, so I better have it. <laughs> I ordered it that the night that they um, announced the album and they announced the My Music Taste thing, so I really like these black and white ones. Okay, it's black and white. Black and white always looks really nice to me. I'm a black and white photo enthusiast. Oh, that hat looks so big on him. Look how big. This hat looks on him. Okay, here's the my music taste. So Hung Joon, also I'll be looking to trade this one too. So Oh look at this. I really, I like these black and whites. Although the hats are a little bit big. <laughs> Kitty. Okay. 
So that is what I got from that one. So now that I've finished completely unpacking that first version. Oh, come on. Close. Okay. We're not going to worry about that. Let's go ahead and answer the next question. So who are my current favorite groups? So I have three old groups. My old groups are X1, BTS, and GOT7. Um, right now I'm highly mainly focused on X1, although I do absolutely love and adore all of them. I actually run the X1 video archive where I am compiling every single X1 video as well as as much information I can gather. I'm just trying to be a information hub for one it's because listen y'all I love X1 so much. Um, I love and adore BTS. I actually will be doing a new comp set. I started working on it before I got busy with some other um, X1 stuff but um, I started working on my comp set for the BTS stuff that I will be doing next. Um, so it's going to get pushed a little bit since I got delayed, but I am working on that next comp set and that should be out hopefully within the next month. Um, yeah, so we're going to be doing that as well very soon too. Um, as far as other groups that I like, um, I update stuff every year and I don't want to really spoil um, my upcoming 20, um, 2019 favorite groups list, which I am going to finally split into a guy group and a girl group one. Um, but I don't want to spoil it, but I do. I love ATs. I love many, many groups. Um, many, many groups. I, I can't even begin. Um, I love Astro. I love Seventeen. I love, um, Winner. I like Vix. I love Shiny. I like New East. Um, I like AB6 now, apparently. Like, there's many, many groups that I love. Like, I love Stray Kids. Um, day six. I, there's many groups. I don't want to spoil my list, <laughs> but there are many groups that I do, do love. I do tend to prefer guy groups over girl groups. Just my preference. Nothing against girl groups. I just, I found that a lot of girl group music, I just don't really vibe with. But when I do finally vibe with a girl group, I'm all in. So like, I love like Red Velvet. I love, um, I really, really like Everglow. Um, but yeah, so why did I choose to unbox this particular item? So before I, while I get into that, let's go ahead and let's start doing this other version. Um, so why did I choose to unbox this item? Well, I choose to unbox this item because it is the latest release to ATs who I have recently decided that I was going to collect. Well, okay, maybe not super recently. I did kind of decide that back with the last release, but I, I didn't actually actively start going to start by the albums and I'm still missing the illusion version. Um, but with this, I am now nearing almost completion with my ATs collection. Um, I am not sure right now, like I mentioned, I do want to trade cards. I'm not sure right now if I am going to be, um, actively looking for trades to actively make sure that I get my bias, in this case, Mingi or Sun. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing that. Um, I may just trade if a, a convenient trade comes up, but I'm not sure that I'm going to actively seek out trades. Um, I may just kind of just take who I get with I get, and if I can trade, then awesome. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at, ooh, black version is already winning to me. Um, so let's go ahead and look at, look at, look at this. Ooh, so, oh, he looks good. Okay. I like this version already. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. This is my preferred version. Um, yeah. Um, I'm all about this version. Oh my gosh. It's the blue. It's the blue sun. Ah, oh, Mingy. His hair is like blending in with like, they couldn't choose like a different like background. His hair is like blending in with the, um, curtain in the back. <laughs> um, yeah. he looks so boyfriend there though. Does he not look like boyfriend to you? He looks, he does to me. Ooh, this is a good look. I like that sweater. I really like that sweater. Look at that tall boy club. 
Ooh, look at, look at, look at this. This is, they did groups of two with this version. Um, the other one they didn't. Okay, okay, okay. I like those. I'm looking forward to opening up these in a second. This, this photo book. What you gonna do to me, photo book? What you gonna do? Let's go. Okay, so here is the group one for the black version. Actually, okay, so. Oh, 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 oh. Sangwa. It's really good. Okay. Okay, they, they threw all the cards in here. So we got the other red one. I'm guessing, yeah, and this is the treasure card. And then so I've got a I'm happy with this. I finally got a bias card. I've been not getting bias cards for a while. Okay, so and then we have another group one. Okay. So I at least got one song card. <laughs> We're gonna see how things go. Oh, this photo shoot, this shoot, this is the money maker. This is the good one. Ooh, ooh. I'm doing looking good, except for I want to rip out those rat tails. Ooh, so I'm going to look at, ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at that one. Look at that one. Okay. The hair, the hair. Okay. I'm going to stop. Um, but yeah, so that's the reason why I chose to unbox ATs because... ATs is a group that I'm getting into and I wanted to show you guys one of the groups that I've decided to embrace into my new collection. Um, I will be doing and planning on doing a collection video at the end of the year. My collection has expanded greatly. I don't think I, I intended to do a collection video at the beginning of the year. Um, well, in the mid, middle of the year, but I ended up not. So collection video will be coming um, for the end of the year and my collection has adapted and changed because I, for a long time, I was really only collecting um, just BTS and GOT7 and Astro. Those were like my main focuses. I would get 17 and Monster X albums as well, um, but I for 17 and Monster X, I did not buy all versions. Um, only The only groups that I did all versions for um, as of last year were um, BTS got seven and Astro. So, um, yeah, my collection has expanded since I've decided to start buying, just buying an album if I really liked it. Um, so whether I I collected a group or not, um, I decided to buy it and that caused me to start collecting some more because I found that there were groups that I liked a lot, like Stray Kids, like 80s where I just wanted to collect more of their stuff because I liked all of the stuff they were putting out so so it looks like I guess um okay so it's like so they're all oh my goodness okay so I end up getting three cards so I have two of these which is um unfortunate I have two member ones though for this one so that is good. Um, granted, I want to trade both of these, but <laughs> um, yeah, so I don't know. I think that is really all. So let me just mention, so I was tagged by Alyssa and I, so I believe because her channel is Osungi's GF. <laughs> I, I can speak. No, I can't. But um, that is, oh my girl, right? I think. <laughs> um, but who am I going to tag? So I'm going to tag Samantha. So I'm going to be tagging Samantha Shawol360, who is super awesome and I've gotten to talking to over the past year. And you should definitely make sure you go check out her video when she drops it because yes, you should because her videos are actually really really fun i really enjoy watching it because they tend to make me laugh she's just so brutally honest and blunt and i appreciate that like no other so yeah 
make sure you go ahead and check that out. But yes, I am tagging Sam. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, and yeah, I'm going to be signing out now because it's time for me to go make dinner and I am rambling. So I will see you guys next time. Bye.